Welcome to Theme Park Fantasy. I'm Beth. And I'm Ted. And we are at the second week of the opening of Disney Springs. And we are bringing you along with us. We are going to be dining at Wine Bar George. Yes, just across from Jock Lindsay's Hangar Bar. Uh, this is our first time going here. Uh, we are very much looking forward to it. So come along with us and let's check it out. So as we head on in, um, they have great protocols, uh, screening in front, and they do have the uh, touching for your phone for the menu. Yeah, the QSR. The QSR. It did not work for our phones, which was not a problem. They had menus, and um, they wiped them down and everything, so they were keeping to the code of you know keeping everything sanitary. Um, I was impressed, though, and um, how pretty the inside is. Here. It's absolutely gorgeous. The Downstairs, wood, nice looking bar with all the glasses, it, you know. And then it has a second floor, which surprised us. We did not realize it was this big. Yeah, I did not think it was this big. They had uh, a lot more seating. They have a second bar upstairs, which was a surprise too, and um, a little deck for eating outside. We chose not to be outside today because it when it rained today. A downpour today. Yeah, we did notice though that the covering is good, so most of those tables did stay dry. They've got maybe what eight tables, six tables out there, um, but you know it did stay dry. And for the inside, as you can see, there was a table in the middle, and then everybody was staggered around it, which was fine because it were it was a you were able to have the social distancing. Yeah, there was a, it. It felt like you were far away from everyone, so it was nice. But, and we wore our masks, and, you know, once we were able to sit down and, you know, relax, and then we took our masks off, and your server keeps his mask on, in case you haven't been down there yet, which is fine. And you can hear him. You can you can understand your server, so yeah. it's not a problem. It's not really a problem. It's just a fact of life today. So. Exactly. And they have sanitary stations, a couple of them, in their restaurant alone. I was very impressed on that. So here we are, um, looking at their uh, liquor. Um, Obviously, it's a wine bar, so they have a huge supply Absolutely. of different reds and whites. One side of the menu is reds, the other's whites. And they have a couple of specialty cocktails, which we'll show you. Um, we I, were lucky enough to see this beautiful uh, rainbow. Rainbow. There was actually two that showed up. It's a little bit harder to see, but there was two that day. It was beautiful. So the first drink it was mine. It was the Citrus Drop of Life. Um, it was a, a pimple, mouse, rose, lemon, and Gordon's gin. Uh, then the next one was the Monk's Estate. That was an Appleton Estate rum um, and lime type drink. It was very nice. And then, you know, finally, Beth, you had... I am the uh, wine person in our family, and I got the red uh, uh, Merlot Michels. And it was fantastic. Uh, very great for the palate. And the two um, drinks that the gentleman got... 